right, Professor Klein here back in the Human Anatomy and Physiology Labs at Ohio University. Today, we're taking a look at the tongue and taste bud model. So let's start first off with the tongue. And if we zoom in here, this is a representation of the entire tongue, as we can see the posterior aspect and the anterior aspect of the tongue. Now, we're gonna look at a few things on here. First off, we're gonna look at the valete papillae. And a papillae is simply an area of concentrated taste buds. So within these bumps, these circular bumps, are a number of taste buds. And if we come up to the top part here, we can see a zoomed in valete papillae as these circles towards the posterior part of the tongue. But what you'll also notice are some smaller bumps and some spikes. These spikes are called the filiform papillae. Filiform and the fungi form are the smaller bumps. Now on the actual tongue, notice these bumps here on the anterior aspect of the tongue. That's the fungi form. And the filiform, although they're spikes, they just would appear as the smooth area. Lastly, on the sides, we can see the foliate papillae. Foliate papillae as these diagonal lines. Back to the top, and actually if we zoom on over to this side, this is a representation of taste buds. So these small dots here are taste buds. But if we zoom in to one taste bud, this is what we've got here. And what we can see is the entire taste bud with the taste pore. So the pore is like the opening for where the taste stimulus would come. And right at the top, these bumps, if you can see those, are the microvilli, picking up that sense for the taste cells. These long cells in here are the taste cells. And the taste cells will send a stimulus or information down a cranial nerve. Now we know the anterior two-thirds of the tongue is cranial nerve seven, and we know the posterior one-third of the tongue is cranial nerve number nine. So make sure you know those cranial nerves, and that's the tongue and taste bud model. Uh, be sure to like this video down below. Give us a thumbs up if you like it, as well as subscribe to this channel for more human anatomy and physiology videos.